staff of the Ghana Airport Company Limited are threatening to lay down their tools in 14 days if the managing director is not removed. The staff in a petition have accused the MD Yao Kwakwa of mismanagement and other conduct they say are not in the best interest of the company, particularly outsourcing at exorbitant costs, key aspects of the company's operations that could be handled by internal units. Kwakwa Santi was at the airport earlier. I reports there were red strips all over the premises. The Kutuka International Airport is red. Staff of the Ghana Airport Company Limited have clad most areas with red cloth to show their anger. According to the union, they want the managing director of the company, Mr. Yao Kwakwa, out for what they say is his gross neglect of the needs of the staff of the company. So as you can see behind me in your shots, the Ghana Airport Company Limited, the staff are up in arms against the managing director of the company, Mr. Yaokwakwa. They are saying he should be removed by the president. They've actually sent a petition. I'm quoting, as leaders of the Divisional Workers Union represented the entire general staff body, we are convinced after engagement with our members at the headquarters and the regional airports that the only way to get the company back on its track and achieve the president's vision of making KIA an aviation hub in the sub-region is the removal of the managing director. Here is Abdul Isaac Abamba, leader of the Ghana Airport Company Limited Workers Union. Yes, and we have a lot of issues and uh, a lot of them bothered on uh, his lack of interest in the welfare of staff. In the welfare of staff. So based on that, we, 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 we are not ready to work with him any longer. Now let me just reference you. This is not coming from only us, the union executives. Before this decision was taken, uh, the executives used almost two months to engage staff is not taking care of our welfare and we think that any good uh, 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 managing director the staff should be his number one assets now if he's not interested in the welfare of staff to the extent that even their health issues are not being taken care of we think he's not the best person to to, to manage the company the union confirms also that their demands are partly due to the purported move to privatize the company it cannot be they cannot be treated in isolation in fact when we add all these things together we can conclude that uh, he had a grand scheme of uh, running the company down and have a good reason to hand it over to the private people that's what we think the 14 days ultimatum to the president to dismiss the ghana airport company limited md expires in two days on thursday it is left to be seen what other action the staff will take to press home their demand but for now their stance remains that the MD has demonstrated gross incompetence and also a lack of critical understanding of the aviation industry, hence his continuous stay will derail the progress of the company.